What's going on guys? My name is Roscoe. Thank you again for tuning into my channel. So in today's video, we're going to cover the Continental 80. I just got these in and uh, there's a lot to cover. There's some positives and some negatives. You've probably seen it all over YouTube already that these are, you know, the back to school must have shoes. Well, I'm going to be completely honest with you in this video and I'm not feeling these at all. So. Let's just dive into it. Let me just give you a first look at the shoe. So without further, let's go. Okay, so here's the shoe right here. All right, let's just go into the positives and the negatives. The positives are definitely the price point. I paid $64 for this shoe, which is a great, great price point. Uh, they usually go for 80 bucks. I was going to get them actually too when they originally dropped. I wanted to compare them to see, because I have the Calabasas, so I wanted to kind of check it out but they were sitting everywhere, so I was like, you know what, maybe they'll hit the sales racks. Well, they haven't yet hit the sales racks, but a lot of like retailers are doing like coupons and back to school sales and all this, so um, they the, the retail I bought them from had like a 20% coupon, so I ended up getting them for like 60 bucks, which is a great, great price point. So that's a huge positive for this show. A negative, I'll give you a negative right off the bat. These are run huge. These run huge. I've been watching reviews all over YouTube and stuff before I bought this shoe, and not once did anybody even mention that. Like, are you serious? Come on, YouTubers, shoe tubers, I should call them. Like this shoe, like this runs like a full size too big. They run a full size too big. I recommend if you're going to interested in this shoe, go to the store and try them on. Like I said, I bought mine online. I bought it true to size, size 12. These fit more like a 13, which is strange because. My Calabasas here are run true to size. So these are 12, they, they fit perfect at a size 12. Positive on this. I like, I, it looks clean. It's a nice looking shoe from like, even when I had them like on foot from the side, I'll, like when I'll, I'll post it at the end of the video when I do the on foot, it looks good. It matches well. I think it goes with a lot of outfits. It's easy to style. I would give it that. I think this is a more, you know, for me personally, this is a better looking silhouette than the Stan Smith's, I think. You know, the Stan Smith is kind of not like my style. This is more like my style. Um, but yet, here's a negative. These look like clown shoes. They look like clown shoes when you, when you just look down at them. I'll post a little video here. I'm wearing the Calabasas on my left, and I'm wearing these on the right. Now, they're both, like I said, they're both size 12. However, like, the rascals, man, the Continentals, they look, they just look huge. They look like clown shoes on me. And I think because this shoe is really perfect for people with wide feet, like they're absolutely perfect for people with wide feet. I don't have wide feet. So I think like the, the bulkiness of this, it's like a bulky, thin, like low top sneaker. It doesn't look good. It just doesn't look good on like when I'm staring down on them. I don't like the look of it. I don't, I just don't at all. Uh, another negative I, I don't like about these, the laces are so long. Like, why? Is that necessary? These things are like, look how, like, look, they're like huge, gigantic bunny ears on the side. And they're flapping around, like, when you walk. That's not needed. Not needed at all. The laces are super cheap, too. They're just cheap laces. Uh, so if I was actually going to keep these, I'd probably, uh, I'd definitely swap the laces out. They're way too long. They're absolutely way too long for this shoe. 
Uh, I do like though, I like how it says Adidas on the back and then it has it on the tongue. I wish the Calabasas has that. Uh, they don't. Um, but I like the touch, I like the design of it, I really do. But the stripe, the stripe is a nice clean look. Uh, what I don't like is that these are not that comfortable. They're, now I'm comparing it again to my Calabasas. The Calabasas are a lot more comfortable than these. They're just like the, the cushion at the bottom when you walk, they're just not, it's not as soft compared to the Calabasas, which is, it's, it's not the end of the world, but it's not, it's not as good, you know what I mean? So, it is what it is, but I don't know. Like, if I was you guys, like, like I said, these are like everywhere, all of YouTube, like, these are back to school, get them for back to school. I wouldn't. I would pass on this shoe, to be honest. I would, you know, if you're going to spend 80 bucks, why don't you just save an extra 20 or extra 40 and maybe go with the, the Adidas PODs or something that just came out. Like a more of a trainer shoe. If you need like a classic silhouette like this, go with like a Stan Smith probably. That might be even better than these. Or maybe you could, if you can get a Calabasas, get a Calabasas. Or if you can't, go with like a Reebok maybe. I don't know. Like I would definitely pass on these. I'm not a fan of these. I would return these like ASAP if I could, but I bought them online and I got them for 60 bucks, so it's not even worth it. So these are going straight to my father's feet. <laughs> I'm giving these to my father. Like I said, these are too big for me. They're a size 12, but they're like a size, they fit like a size 13. So these will fit my dad. And I feel like these are a dad shoe, man. These are more of a dad shoe. Because <laughs> they're just, I don't know. I just don't like them. I don't like how they look on feet with me. Uh, so these are definitely a no go for me. Which is disappointing. It's disappointing, like I said, because I wanted these from the start. But it is what it is. So, guys, that's my video for today. If you guys enjoyed it, please smash that like button and subscribe to my channel. Uh, next video I have coming, I have some more shoes coming in, so we're going to be doing more sneaker reviews and some clothing too. I got some babe stuff coming in that I want you guys to check out. We'll do a review. So, uh, like I said, I appreciate you guys watching. Hey, and I'll catch you in the next video. Peace.